My name is Hiro Yamada. I'm a third year in Koiba High School. Thanks to my friend Otakuda, I am able to live a peaceful life here without standing out. That's the Koiwa gang that's growing in power right now. If I recall properly, the chief is Karen Matsumoto, who's in the same class as us. Seems so. Karen is known as the prettiest girl in our school. There are many boys who drowned in her beauty. However, she's also famous as the fierce, scary chief of the female gang known to beat up any man in the area. Hey, what are you looking at? You want to fight? Hmm? Hmm. Oh, of course not. We don't mean to. Uh. Ch chief! Girls, get back. Sorry. Sorry! Get lost. Uh. Oh, we're terribly sorry. Hey, Otaku. My name is Otaku Da. Well, as expected from your chief. Oh, amazing. Hmm. This fierce chief that everyone was afraid of, there was a completely different side of her. And that was... M master Mm-hmm. You have to wake up, or else I'll kiss you. Oh! Oh, oh so you're awake now? Oh, that's too bad. What's too bad? Gosh, why are you here? Well, this is my job, isn't it? That's right. This was the secret side of the fierce, famous chief. Karen works at my place as my personal maid. And the truth is, I am the only son of the Yamada conglomerate. Karen suddenly appeared at our place one year ago. Uh, one year ago, Karen had helped my mother from a thief. My mother forced her to join her for tea as a way of saying thank you. And then, as they had a conversation, my mother found out that Karen lived in an orphanage. Karen was planning on leaving the orphanage after graduating high school, but she was unsure as to what she wanted to do after that. That was when my mother made a surprising suggestion. My, then why don't you come to our place? Huh? And the chief of a female gang, you know? My, that's so cool. It's wonderful that you're doing what you want to do. But why don't you come and try it out at least once, hmm? And with that, Karen reluctantly agreed and came to our place. Huh? Karen? Huh? You're... from the same class. Oh, my, my. So you two know each other. Then you be his personal maid. Huh? huh? With that, things went quickly, and my mother finished filling out the documents for her employment. Since then, Karen has been living in our mansion while working and doing the chores for the Yamada family. So, this is her home too. Of course, we let her prioritize her gang activities and only have her work when she's open. Well then, you must change. Uh... Please let go, Master! Wait a second. I... I can do it myself! Hmm. Master, master! Wait a second! Mm -hmm. Of course, at first, since it was her job, there was a larger distance between us. However, as time went by, we got closer, and here we are now. She teases me every day, and our relationship has turned into a strange, unique one. However, the only ones who knew about us were my family and the other maids. Karen was afraid that we will be targeted if people found out that we were close. Thus, we pretended that we had nothing to do with each other outside. I finished changing. Master! Hey, Karen! Why don't you allow me to take care of you? I'm sorry, but I'd like to do what I can for myself. Well then, I'll wash you back tonight. I, I can do that myself! Like this, she troubles me because she's overly friendly with me. However, I am very thankful for all the things she does for me. The maids in my mansion have been with me in place of my busy parents, and they were like family to me. Of course, that was the same for Karen. However, when I told her about how I felt the other time, she reacted in a dry manner. Maybe I was inconsiderate for using the word family? 
Well, yeah, that sums up my everyday life. In reality, however, there were many things that troubled me. For example, one day after school... Master, you look tired. Uh, no, don't worry. No, I can see the fatigue. You can't fool me. Your whole body's worn down and tired. That much? So please lay down. Uh, a few minutes later. How is it? Yeah, it feels good. <laughs> but this is bad for my heart. I mean, do you have to be this close? I can't use my strength properly unless I go like this. Yeah, but... You know, this is my job. Like this, she changes drastically at home. On another occasion... Um, is this how you make it? Karen was being scolded quite harshly today. She seemed quite depressed. Master? Uh, what are you... Uh, um, this is... Ow! What's wrong? Uh, <laughs> I guess I cut it, uh, but this is nothing. Master's precious hand! Uh. What? Uh, thanks! I'm fine now! Gosh, I thought my heart was going to jump out of my chest. I'll take care of it properly. Please sit down. Uh. What were you doing at this time of night? I wanted to make some sweets. Sweets? Then we can have our pastry, chef. No, no. I wanted to cheer you up, so I wanted to make it myself. But I'm not allowed in here during the day, so... Huh? What? Gosh, master. K karen I'm very blessed to be serving a wonderful master like you. Uh, her, her smile. I can't. And then a few days later on a holiday. Is Karen here? The maid leader is searching for her. Uh, master, I'll be right there. Huh? Be careful. Yeah. Ow. Uh, master, are you injured? I'm fine. How about you? I'm okay. I'm glad. I'm terribly sorry. It's fine, so please don't apologize that much. No, I should have gone under you to protect you. Uh, no way! Huh? That's not how it should be. Please take better care of yourself. You're precious. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, sorry for shouting in a loud voice. No. Um, I'm really fine. Besides, you're supposed to say thank you and not sorry at times like this. Yes, Master, thank you. You're welcome. I believe that such peaceful days like this would continue forever. However, one day, the accident occurred. Nero, we've got a problem. Just now, Karen. Huh? Otakura told me that just a few minutes ago, Karen was taken away by some delinquent men who were waiting for her by the school gate. Otakura found out about this when he saw the student bystanders gossip about it. Why did that happen? They said something like, come with us if you don't want your precious master to get hurt, or something like that. What? It's my fault that Karen is in danger. Are you okay, hero? Otakuda, do you know where they went? I think they were the delinquent gang who rules this area. I've heard that an abandoned factory in Tokisu Ward is their base. Thank you, Otakuda. Be careful. Yo, yo, yo. It's been around a year, I suppose. Huh? We could have snatched that idiot's bag easily if it weren't for you. You got yourself into this, you know. You're the Snatcher, huh? Correct. I didn't think that you were part of his household, though. And that's why we couldn't find you. Ugh. But, well, time to give up. You can't escape anymore. You don't have your precious rich master's guards here today. <laughs> what a coward. Huh? What did you say? 
My life has been a mess since I met you. Nothing goes right. Huh? So you're blaming it on me? Lame. <laughs> you can only say that now. You know what happened if you hit back, right? Ugh. Haha, <laughs> serves you right. I'll take good, good care of you today. Ha <laughs> uh. uh, What? You little... Huh? Sorry to keep you waiting, Karen. Why... Are you... Ow, uh, uh, ow, 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 ow! It'll break! Stop! How dare you? What, what do you want? This bitch did... Wait, you're the rich kid she serves. Please run away. Ah, how lucky I am. I didn't even have to find you. I'll take you as a hostage and demand for more money. Why don't you try? Boys, get him. Yeah! A few minutes later. <laughs> you done? Wow. This way! Please hurry! Uh, the cops must escape. You've got some explaining to do later. Be still. Karen! Master! I'm glad you're safe. Why would you? That was dangerous. Because you're my precious person. <gasps> uh, so sorry. No, no. Anyway, I didn't know you were this strong, Master. Uh, yeah. The truth is, I've been doing most of the martial arts since I was a kid. My family was worried I'd be targeted since I'm the son of a rich family. I see. But how must I make up for this? It put you in so much trouble because of me. Uh, no, remember? At times like this, you say... Th thank you. Very much. You're welcome. Huh? Karen, you know, I was dying inside when I heard you were taken away. Yes? Um, because I love you. Uh. So I'm saying... Me too. From the day you told me that I was precious, you have always been the most precious person to me. That day... You mean, when I told you about how thankful I am? Yes. I've always been alone. I couldn't believe you told me I was as precious to you as your family. But at that time... I got embarrassed because it was the first time someone said that straight in my face. Ah, uh, I see. I was too shy to say this then, but... I would always be by your side from now on and ever. That means... I love you, too. Karen! Ah, I'm really glad we made it. Oh, Takuda, thank you, really. You saved us. Not at all. It seems they've been doing some really bad things in this area. The police moved right away when I told them about what happened. Oh, but why did you call for me, Otakuda? Oh, you two have a very close relationship, correct? Uh, you thought we didn't notice? Wow, you're really something, Otakuda. And then a few days after that, my relationship with Karen hasn't changed. She's cold to me outside, but is clingy inside the house. And by the way, when we told my mother about our relationship... Oh, so now I finally have a daughter. I really hoped this would happen since the day we met. Like this, she was thrilled as tears poured down her cheeks. My father is going to come back to Japan soon, too, and we are all happy we get to meet all together again. And then, one day, during dinner... I tried extra hard today and made these meals! Wow! Then let's eat it together! No, I will feed you! No, I can eat it myself! Mmm! Delicious! Then please give me my treat! Pat my head, boy! <laughs> she, she's so cute. Karen started expecting treats from me like this. Hero, you've got something here. Huh? Uh. Uh, 
gosh, Master. What would you do without me? I'll be right by your side forever. I realize that this adorable maid of mine would be messing with my heart from now on and ever. Hi, it's me, Mel. Thanks for watching my channel. I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too.